Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Uh, so first things first, I have been looking for a new job for several months now and I am finally selected for the training grounds. Far far away from where I live now, almost uh, 1800 kilometers. I will have to move to a new place for a week, so no PC with me for a while. I got to set everything up there before I come back to YouTube. I know it will take only 2-3 days to feel like I should be making more videos but this is the situation right now. Alright, with that out of the way, what do we have in the game for the next month? I guess most of you already know by now. It's the Clash of Titans contest. They couldn't call it the Clash of Champions because the word Champions is used to represent us and we are not fighting against each other. So this time, we got Titans and Mini Titans to face. These are some superstars that will appear during the contest so we can fetch points, get milestone rewards. So Titans are... Um, some superstars that will be like bosses and we can simply beat them again and again to get points uh, that seems to be the theme of the contest so okay usually i make these videos after it gets live in the game because sometimes it seems very easy very uh, approachable event from the wall of text until it's uh, live in the game but let's go through some points, uh, some main points that I found interesting this time. We got four new featured superstars for this month. The Planet's Champion, Daniel Bryan, Trickster, Deputy Dango Fandango, who is a showboat, Prince Pretty, Tyler Breeze, who is a striker, and against all odds, it says, Kofi Kingston. Now we already know we have a acrobat Kofi, the only class he can be put in, I think. For him to be a technician is a far reach, but then again, you cannot place him in any other class. So, I guess technician is fine. And out of these four, at the time of recording, we have Daniel Bryan and Fandango in the not in loot, not in loot section. And judging by the training abilities, uh, Bryan might be useful to some of the trap gem guys like Jinder or in future where every trap gem user will have a move that destroys trap gem there may be some i'm forgetting but uh, that is one useful training ability at least in the future it will be i believe uh, it will be one ability to look out for so daniel bryan is a must have i think at least for me and uh, so for the rest of the contest i think it is similar with short blitzes Restricted tours, mini contests like Coin, EV, T EVO, TP. We do have perks still and you got to use them to progress in the solo contest. Overall, uh, solo contest is just getting coins from mini contests and tours and spending turnbuckles for perks. We will have 800 shards from the kickoff event itself uh, for Daniel Brand and the rest will be distributed like previous contest. From the not in loot section in the game, Brian requires only 20 shards to be recruited at 2 star bronze. That is awesome, but it can be changed. As I said, until this is live, nothing is confirmed and uh, it can be changed anytime. So this is just the blog post that I am referring to right now. Anyways, personally, as I said before, uh, I require zombies to help most of my roster. So I will still keep my enhances for this event. If Daniel Bryan can be recruited, I might think it again. Think about it. But uh, for now, I feel like I need to skip this talent up and also just get the rewards from tours and uh, progress to milestone. So I got to be ready for the next one. I don't even know if next one is going to be a zombie event or not. But I have to be prepared. Uh, for this one, I will see if I can recruit some superstars. Uh, I'm not sure without participating you can. But uh, I will have to look at it. And the zombie event, it happens once a year. So I have to save some for that one. Another contest uh, that I will have to stand beside a highway. Looking at every contest go across. <laughs> but if you like the superstars and like this contest, best of luck. One more thing I forgot to talk about, uh, the prize wall contains superstars this time and uh, these superstars can be claimed with contest coins. Um, 
directly it says up to three star bronze so it is likely that these superstars are required superstars for the tour and we can recruit them from there uh, this is the best part of the contest i think uh, the prize wall with the superstars and of course uh, these fuses will certainly help a lot and uh, rest is all more or less uh, similar to the previous one we got fewer currencies to deal with this time at least all right uh, that will be it for this video guys uh, thanks for watching i will return soon with more content just need to settle down in a new place i hope you guys understand so have a nice day good luck with the clash of titans and see you guys in the next video soon bye bye